Hello, sweet souls. Happy Friday. It is December 8th. It's going to be your full length reading on TikTok and YouTube. If I see the 10 minutes, follow me on YouTube and watch the remaining of the reading. I am thinking about going live uh, tomorrow at 1 p.m. Eastern time for $25 uh, one question mini reads. So if you're interested, I will announce it, make it official in the morning, but I am thinking about that. Okay. I'm going to call on St. Michael. St. Michael, please return to sender anyone sending a will, do thought, word, or action toward myself or the viewer. I'm going to call on the Holy Spirit, angel saints, spirit guides, and ancestors, and ask for a message for your greater good. All right, so let's see. What does the collective need to know in the present energy? Wow. Definitely receiving. Okay. So there is a blessing that's coming in. And whoops, this blessing is tied to the truth. This blessing is also tied to what is fair, justice. And it puts you in the receiving end of a gift. So there is some sort of truth being revealed that is a blessing for you. This is justice. This is the scales being balanced. And then we see you receiving. This has to do with a karmic energy with not for you. So you're about to be blessed from a situation that was unjust and some truth is about ready to be revealed. So let's just get into this and see what this is about. Please clarify blessed. Please clarify blessed. Oops. Clarify, blessed. So with blessed, a blessing is coming in because you've closed out a cycle and you are standing in this Queen of Swords energy, speaking your truth, cutting out what no longer serves you. You're standing in your integrity. You're standing in your truth. And that's why a blessing is coming in for you. Then we see someone that made a poor investment. They're not able to move away from the situation. They have no peace in their life and they are going through significant endings. So there's two different energies. There's your energy receiving a blessing because you have stood in your integrity, speaking your truth, and you've closed a cycle. And then we see a second energy who can find no peace in the situation that they've invested in because they can't get away from it and there is endings happening in that situation. Okay, let me just get one more. What is the death card? The death of a karmic uh, connection. I feel like if your past person left you for someone else, that karmic connection is ending. All right, let's clarify. <clears throat> Truth be told. Truth be told. Wow. We have, with the truth be told, the truth. The truth is we have someone here that's been operating in devil energy, very toxic, low vibrational, doing a lot of deceptive things. We have, and they're in regret for it. Five of cups to the devil to the seven of swords. The truth is coming out about someone who did some very devious things uh, behind your back. This could have to be, this could have to do with someone paying to block, to stop you, to interfere with your forward movement. But this truth is coming out, and it has to be someone from the past. Wow. All right. Please clarify justice, to be fair. Well, there is, this hangman came out sideways. So this is a blockage. Someone either tried to create stagnation in your life and it was, it was unsuccessful, or this is someone that is stuck, unable to see from a different perspective. Either way, justice for you is God is guiding you toward a brand new beginning, a new life, a new start. Give me one more for justice, please, to be fair. Yeah, a new love offer coming in or a new offer in general coming in. A new beginning. Okay, please clarify exchanging gifts. Wow, exchanging gifts.
you know, you are in the receiving end of building this legacy, generational wealth, because you've been committed and devoted. Slow and steady wins the race. You are on the receiving end of opportunities that lead to building this generational wealth. And someone tried to block this on an energetic level. Who tried to block your blessings? Who tried to block your growth, your finances? Who tried to block the collective's finances? Who tried to block the collective's finances? It could be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sag, and they're going to go through a tower. Now, it could be a masculine or a feminine. It's energy. But they're going to experience the tower because they tried to block you building your legacy, you having financial security. Wow. Okay, please clarify not for you. Wow. Yeah. Ace of Wands reverse. There is no passion to give this person. You've healed from the deceptions and betrayal this person has put you through. So you are well aware that this, whoever this energy is, they are not for you. I'll get one more for not for you. Yeah. This person creates illusion and confusion wherever they go. It's dark energy. They've caused you great pain, heartbreak. All right. So let's clarify with the Kipper now. So with blessed, we see you're in the energy of receiving. You're receiving a blessing because you've closed the cycle. You're being your true authentic self. You're standing in your integrity. And then we see another energy who made the wrong investment and has no peace. And the investment that they made, um, they can't move on from it. They are experiencing significant endings. And I asked what is ending and they said a karmic partnership. So whoever this past person of yours is connected to is going through an ending with this karmic relationship. Please clarify blessed. Yeah, adjudication and main female. This is a karmic feminine energy. Maybe taking this masculine from your past or flip or switch the roles to court over a house. They could be trying to take their home, the home from the masculine. Need one more. Yeah, coffin again. Death and coffin. It's over. There's an ending here. And it looks as though this karmic feminine is going to try to take this masculine to court for the house. Wow. Okay. With truth be told, we see the truth is coming out about this masculine who was very uh, toxic in devil energy, deceiving, lying, cheating, stealing, um, giving to multiple. This is someone from your past who's heavy in regret but the, because the truth is being revealed. Truth be told, please. Yeah, they're in despair and in bad health. Receiving news, receiving a message. What is this message? That they're trapped or they may be going to physical prison. For if they committed a crime, they could be going to physical prison. With justice, to be fair, we see that someone either tried to keep you in a stuck, stagnant energy or this is someone refusing to see from a different perspective. But the scales are being balanced. God is here bringing in new opportunities, new offers, and a new life. Please clarify to be fair. Wow, that just flew on the floor. This person from the past is losing their honor, their reputation for the things that they have done. And you have sudden wealth. With exchanging gifts, we see that you are receiving you're receiving opportunities that allow you to build generational wealth because you have been committed and devoted. This is slow and steady wins the race. Despite the efforts of someone to try to block your forward movement, this is a fire sign or a fiery energy <clears throat> that tried to do this and will go through the tower because of their actions to block you. Please clarify exchanging gifts. Distant horizon and great fortune. What's coming in for you, this is energetically, which we always hear, you know, it happens on an energetic level before the 3D plane. We have distant horizon and great fortune. You can expect great fortune. And your pathway is clear. You are the privileged lady. All right. With not for you, we see there is no 
no passion left for this karmic energy. You have no passion to give this person. You've already healed from the deception, betrayal that they put you through. All they do is create confusion and illusion and cause you pain. So you know this person is not for you. Please clarify, not for you. Wow. So whoever this person is that's not for you, they went down the wrong path with journey sideways. They made the wrong decision. This took them down a karmic path for unexpected income. But what's happening is this person, they're not getting the income that they expected. And they're also losing their rank, spiritual rank, rank in the 3D realm. They didn't think something through before they took action. Another card. Yeah, they're in a very dysfunctional family environment. And change is occurring. What is this change? Change in a marriage that's falling apart. And you are the mature woman in the upright. So whatever was done, this is not affecting you. These people will be in poverty. And this is a message of concern. Then we have a wealthy man here and mature man. Yeah, so you have a new suitor, feminine or masculine, coming in. And a person from your past has done everything to try to block this person from coming in and courting you. They've also tried to block your occupation, the work that you do. This is a thief who wanted to steal your gift with a community of people. And now they're concerned because with courthouse, they're being brought to justice. Whatever they've done to stop or block you is being brought to justice. God has seen it. And the truth is coming to light. But you are receiving a gift. I can see that. All right. Let's see if we can get any more information in part two. I love you guys. I hope that you have an amazing day. Bye-bye.